Hey guys, before I begin, there will be spoilers throughout this entire video, so that's definitely something to look out for. Today, I'm going to talk about the ending to Metalhead and add some clarity to one very simple question that everyone is wanting the answer to after watching this episode, which is, why in the world would three people risk their own lives to save a teddy bear in a world filled with murderous robots rampaging around with the sole purpose of trying to kill every single human in existence? Gosh, this episode is so bleak and really freaking ambiguous, and because of its ambiguity, this is more of my bias interpretation based off of what was only given to us in the episode. So in order to better help find the answer to this question, we're going to go start with the cinematography of Metalhead. It's hard to miss that this episode is in black and white, and we see other tonally darker episodes with very desaturated images in Black Mirror, and this is done to add to the overall miserable tone of those episodes, but Metalhead goes full black and white, making the overall environment so much more lifeless, deserted, and hopeless, which is really fitting to Bella's entire situation because it is just that hopeless. There are a few sentences that actually really stuck out to me in this episode and it was mainly during the opening when they were waiting in the car. Bella mentions that there is something in the warehouse that they want and it would aid a male member of their group as he is dying from something that's unknown to us. The kid in the back of the car named Clark claims he's dying anyway what has he got days and bella says what if we can make those days easier also later after they get out of the car anthony asks her are you sure it's going to be in there and she replies of course i'm not sure we learn from these hopeful remarks that she is an optimist not being sure what they need is in this building but still risking her life to find it and when i was reading up on audience reactions to this episode some people were aggravated by the amount of ambiguity and unanswered questions that come along with metalhead but the questions that people wanted answers to like what time in the future are they in? What are dogs? How did they take over the earth? Did drones really cause the destruction of humanity? And why are they killing everyone? And just general history about the story Bella is in. But it doesn't really matter. The message of this episode is really black and white. It's human versus something trying to kill them. A loving human with so much fight and willpower in her contrasted with a one-dimensional emotionless killing machine. Metalhead is a story about survival and it's revealed to us that she was trying to find something not just for a member of their group but for a dying child. Then at the end of the episode we see that it was a box full of teddy bears of all things in the world that's what they were going after a package of teddy bears it wasn't a cure and it wasn't going to save the world and it wasn't something that was going to save the child it was only going to make the small amount of time the kid has left on this earth a little less terrible and she thought that was something worth dying for in one of the most hopeless episodes she fights until the better end and we are shown the box of teddy bears as a last shot to show us that she risked her life and went through all of this struggle for something so pure and innocent. The message of this episode is actually like Bella's character, pretty optimistic. The reveal of the teddy bears is to show us that in one of the most bleak, and hopeless worlds presented to us in Black Mirror, she is still trying to recover some hope. And that's all I had to say about Metalhead. I absolutely love Black Mirror. So if you guys like this video essay and want to see more Black Mirror videos like this one, let me know in the comments and I can keep making them. And please subscribe to keep this channel going. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in my next ending explained video.